from a big musical family. I just remember people playing everywhere. I just wanted to be like my uncles. So I picked up drums and piano. I, I sucked at them. So I picked <laughs> up a guitar. I was like, oh, I'm pretty good. After auditioning about like 300 singers, I found Troy. Black ties, fireflies, shot legs and a scream. Whoa, you gotta get away from me. I got caught by my choir teacher in ninth grade, sitting in the back of the room. I joined choir to listen to like the girls sing because I thought it was a really pretty sound. And he caught me after a couple weeks like, why are you here? Like I haven't seen you sing or do anything. And he like forced me to sing in front of the whole class. And I didn't even know I had a voice until then. And then uh, he really made a point of helping me along and making sure that I took care of my voice and kind of expanded on what I had. You gotta come down, though we never fall the way I had. never happens at all. Oh. I'd rather give away a million records than sell a thousand. Just to get the music out there to as many people as you can. At this point, we're not gonna make a living by selling records. There's just so many new outlets to make money uh, in, as a band. You got to get creative. Finding the right way, I would say, to traverse the very, very tricky path of the music business now. To love a song as much as we love it, to give that away and kind of show people that we're doing this so that you guys can enjoy it the same way that we do, I think that that translates more than buy this record, buy this record. It's a really good record, buy this record. Utah has done a lot of promotion, and for some reason we've been played in rotation in France and Spain. Canada, Spain, France, and uh, Netherlands, and US, and Japan. So I've been doing interviews like crazy, and it's just weird. And he tricked me one day. We were driving, and he's on the phone with someone. He gives me the phone, and the guy goes, are you ready? I'm like, okay, for what? You're in the air, Joss. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> some radio station in Canada. I wake up on a Saturday, and Yutaka emails me, oh, look at this. And a woman from Romania, Romania, mind you, <laughs> has done a set of oil paintings oh, of all of us. <laughs> I'm talking <laughs> portrait oil paintings. I thought it was She's awesome. She's sending my picture. <laughs> yeah? She's sending her painting to me. Nice. <laughs> really? It's in the mail right now, yeah. <laughs> well, me.